let's get started by setting up a new React application. So this is npx, create React app, and we're going to call this app React Roku. This is going to install React, React DOM, and it's going to initialize the project. Okay. Now let's get into the folder, React Heroku. And now let's build our React application. So this is npm run build. This is going to generate the React application into the build folder. Our production build has been successfully generated. So now let's work with the Heroku CLI to deploy our application. Okay, now we need to install the Heroku CLI. So this is npm install. We're going to install this globally. This is minus G, and this is Heroku. And now we're going to need to log into Heroku using the CLI. This is Heroku login. And here we need to enter our credentials. Of course, you need to create an account first. So I'm going to log in here and I'm logged in. So you can close this page and return to your CLI. I'm going to close this and I'm going to go back. And from here, I'm going to create a new Heroku application. So this is Heroku create. And I'm going to call this app React Heroku Pragmatic. And this is going to generate the URL to access our application. And this is also going to create a remote GitHub repository that we're going to need to add to our project. So this is git remote add Heroku. And we need to paste this URL here. Now let's take a look at the git repository URL for Heroku git remote minus v and this is the url of our heroku application and if we go to the heroku dashboard and if we enter to our application and if we go to settings we're going to see that this is the heroku git url git.heroku.com slash react heroku pragmatic it's the same value that we have here Okay, and now we need to commit all our changes. So first, let's add all the changes. Git add everything. Git commit minus m. This initial initial commit. Now let's push all the changes. Git push Heroku master. And this is going to deploy the application to Heroku. It's going to detect that we are deploying a React application. It's going to detect NPM. And the application has been deployed to Heroku, to this URL. So if we enter to this URL, and as you can see here, our React application is running on Heroku on this URL, reactherokupragmatic.herokuapp.com. That's all I have for today. Thank you guys for watching and I see you guys in the next one. Take care. Bye. Mm -hmm.